I was really excited and will always be very excited and honoured to have been chosen for this year's Roundel competition. I couldn't think of anything more encouraging than to be backed by a panel of my contemporaries. Being a part of the Reflections of the Lord Mayor was really exciting. Um, I thought it was wonderful how many different foundations and charities and companies they involved during the event. When I created this design for Lord Mount Evans, I wanted to I create a compelling visual piece of stained glass that incorporated elements of stained glass as a heritage and also innovative art form. One formal aspect I wanted to include in the design was the perimeter of the City of London, uh, which is depicted here in red glass. Um, I also overlapped with paint, different painted details, uh, incorporating different architecture and buildings of the City of London. Uh, this was all layered with um, details of an uplifting and uh, momentous body of water that basically carried certain vessels out of the inno innovative and uh, specialised uh, environment of London and the City of London to our global community. Um, I couldn't have done this actual technique in the centre of the roundel without using a special type of glass, which is uh, mouth-blown Lambert's glass where one side of the glass has a different colour to its actual body. Um, so by sandblasting away some of this colour, I was able to use and distribute colour in a slightly more modern way than uh, just dividing colour by lead. Um, I, after sandblasting this type of glass, to get rid of the opacity and the texture, kiln polished it, which has created a wonderful tactile surface um, with the ability to reflect light as well as it transmits light. I have different motifs incorporated in the uh, border of the roundel, kind of referring to the goldsmiths, wheelwrights, uh, the House of Lords, um, England and also the City of London. Um, again, a lot of these details have been sandblasted and kiln polished. I wanted to embody certain interests of the Lord Mount Evans considering that uh, a lot of his involvement is in the maritime community. I thought that that was an important theme to base the roundel and its concept off. I would like to thank very much the organisers of the Reflections of the Lord Mayor and also the Worshipful Company of Glaciers and Painters of Glass for creating an opportunity like this. There are not too many avenues for the glass artist to travel down um, to obtain certain opportunities and progress themselves in their trade, but this was a wonderful opportunity and I'd highly recommend any glass artist applying to it in the future.